Hey, Vicky Crystal and Mr. Edward. So funny. So my channel just came through and I didn't hit record, but it feels so perfect. Hmm. Perfect. So I'm going to tap in and bring forth this beautiful message. Oh, for whatever. Hmm. Breathe deep into the body. Allow yourself to feel the flow of you. Recognize it. There is the light pouring through you right now. Balancing, connecting, guiding. It's all you showing you. As you are tapped in, this is your presence. The beloved channel, Mr. Edward, we're discussing some things that we are going to bring forward here. This beloved channel has been recognizing the weight that is put upon her body when she allows the worries to step in, the fears of life. of just surviving, we would say, for right now. It is heavy in the consciousness. The whole world is being affected. As you allow yourself to be drugged into the mud of life, it feels Harder, we would say, heavier resistance on your bodies for the whole planetarium is doing it. As you step out of that and step in to your presence just with the breath, You will feel yourself not connected to that any longer. It washes away from your systems. As you tap in, you are noticing the difference. There is no judgment here if you drag yourself through the mud. You are stepping back quite fast now because the heaviness of the world, you are feeling it. Yet when you step back into balance of oneself, You feel it wash away. 
and it's like in a way you're above it. What we mean is you stand taller, your body is free, you can breathe. This is being in the flow of life. Connected to all, yet not filling the mud of life. In the flow, you are connected to all, so everything resides with you and it comes to you instantly within moments. Your bodies are adapting to do something that has not been done in a long time and you are feeling the pain at times of life of the mud. You may be feeling at times, I've had enough. I cannot do this any longer. My body feels like it's dying. The dying part is showing you, all parts are showing you, move back into balance. That's it, nothing more. Your light in balance, in flow, radiates right to the world. It softens the energy below. It shines through eternity. For far too long, you have held yourself that you are this peace-sized being, living life, struggling through life. Yet with one breath, one breath, one breath, you can bring your back, your life, your balance, your flow. You are seeing this in the world of the separation. Many are talking about this. This is what is happening in your bodies and your bodies are adapting to this. Your bodies are letting the struggles go. All this stuff that you carry on your body What are you are needing for your body is breath, is flow, is balance. You will do this for a while of tapping in, then re-going back to the mud, then tapping in, and then going back to the mud. This is perfect. It is showing you, you. If it does not feel good, oh, let's move this. I breathe. It instantly balances you. We are going to speak about this, for many are going through this also in your bodies. The food that you are consuming, you are recognizing, it does not matter what it is, your state is 
slowed. It's not balancing your energy. To help yourself, help your body. And yes, we will say this. Grow your own food. Put your own energy into your food. Even if it is not processed by you. Your energy affects. There is so much that is going on in the body. It is acclimating into a new way. So you will feel the call of detoxing, deworming, recalibrating, restoring. When you feel these calls, trust that. It is helping the body to move the energy for stagnant energy. Is being held very, we will say the word, powerfully in the mud. And it is affecting the light bodies with your own energy you can change what you are consuming no matter what it is this is very beneficial to your life you are learning to work with your own being and we struggle to say the word work where it is just becoming who you truly are and you are recognizing how to move the energies and when you are in the flow your energies are moving without resistance I doesn't that feel good? We would say, is there a question? We are even asking to the collective. Hmm. Mm. What just popped in for me is the eclipses coming up. Mm. Can you speak into those, please? We are recognizing not just on yours or the beloved's, but we are recognizing even on the collective. Many have different ideas about this beautiful event. Yet they are only ideas. Each will experience it differently in their own ideas. We will say but loads we will change that. What lies 
beneath the ground has been surfacing for a while now. The grid has been built to sustain we would call a power unit on. This is assisting the separation. Many fear this event. Yet that is their idea. And they will experience that idea. We would say it is not right what the highs are saying it is. We would say it's a power point. Turning on. Even in your own body right now. You can feel the energy in your bottom half of your body. For you are part of that grid. So we will say it is a powering up for the whole collective. Shine light. Shine bright. Shine like a diamond. Did this answer your question, beloved? Yeah, perfectly. Thank you. Mm. We feel this was perfect. So this is on a lot of people's mind. Everything is here to assist you. And you're a part of that. We are with you always. Okay. Wow. Thank you. Hi. Hmm. No, oh, the breathing, yes. It's just it's that simple, isn't it? Yeah, it's so simple. So simple. So simple. It was like I got a review of my life, you know, the last couple of weeks of how checking in. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Faith and grace. Truly. 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 Man, my whole, we tapped into the eclipse. My whole, like root chakra and sacral chakra, are lit up. Mm. I'm I, ready for. You're feeling it too? The root, yeah. 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 Beautiful. Mm. That is truly really good. Nice and love. And you all be blessed.